black guy over there? He looks familiar. You have my money. Why don't you just forget about working and be with me? Oh, yeah. And be one of those wives like Carmela Soprano. Breastfeed a bunch of rugrats and then spend the rest of your life at the gym. Just you and your stretch marks. Yeah, you're right. Cousin's always had a brain, but what does she use it for? Mm. A husband who can't even tell you where the money comes from. Yo, hand that central. What am I back here, Mark Furman? Hey, you a dick, man. You chill. It's fucking discrimination already. Hey. About time. Excuse me. Bold men make bold statements. Why they send you over? I'm looking for a burger, not converted rice. Your woman looks embarrassed. Mona, give me a couple of burger baskets. He's only bold because he sent me hooked up with the Tony Soprano crew. Wait up! Who's with the attitude, Christopher? If it's not the blacks, it's somebody else. Whoa! Nice. Must belong to the homie with the blue hat. Yo, Donnie Brasco. Yeah. My name is Orange J, down with Massive Genius. That's who it was, the gangster rapper. I told you to shut up. We're having a party at G's crib, Inglewood Cliffs. You interested? And I get served with Black Eyed Peas tomorrow? Yo, I know what time it is. Massive's heard of the fucking crew you with. There's business to be done. Home. Smaller than my Hamptons crib, but that's bigger than Stevens. It's Italian contractors, obviously. Christy, look at all these gold records. Whoa. What do we have here? You like that shit? A Christmas present to myself? Isn't that a sight to behold? I do so love a good firearm in my hand. You people are all right. Godfather, I've seen that movie 200 times. Godfather 2 was definitely the shit. The third one, a lot of people didn't like it, but I think it was just misunderstood. What kind of business you want to discuss? Mr. Herman Rabkin. Ash. I don't know him personally, but I know his history. In the late 50s and 60s, he owned F Note Records. I don't know what it was fucking called, but yeah, Hesh was in the music business. Little situation here. A distant but deceased quasi-cousin on my mother's side, little Jimmy Willis, 50s legend. Two seminal hit records was his legacy. Drug tragedy. Such a fool. Oh, I love that. They play all the time on Altice Radio. Oh, Herman, he's just another in a long line of white motherfuckers stealing royalties from the black men that made them the money in the first place. Jimmy's mother, out San Bernardino, who I'm content to call my aunt, is owed that money. <laughs> Hesh is the world's sweetest guy, but I've heard his opinions on giving back pieces of Israel. I can only imagine what he's gonna say about this shit. Feel free to enjoy the food and any other enjoyments. Champagne, sir? Ma'am? Yeah. 